All right, y'all, I'm going to go ahead and get into this. As y'all can see, right there, <laughs> that's Psylocke. Uh, but anyways, uh, I played at Marvel. Uh, I really liked the game. Uh, I really, uh, really enjoyed Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 the most. Uh, and I really, really liked that game. But, uh, like, it's, it's, it's still flawed, it, or at least it's, it's certain things that I haven't really figured out yet, or I can understand or see about it. But, as, uh, what is it? It's 2022, and that game came out in, when, 2000, damn, was it 2011? Yeah. Yeah, it came out 2011. Uh, yeah, uh, it's been over 10 years. <laughs> <laughs> it's been over 10 years. It's been 10 long years. <laughs> and uh we want another Marvel. <laughs> we want that Marvel 4. Uh so whenever that can ever come out cuz as we can tell that Marvel Infinite was not not anything in likeness of Marvel 2 or Marvel 3, Ultimate Marvel 3. So it's just kind of like we we would like another Marvel, please. <laughs> as, uh, as, uh, but for what I can tell about what I would want for the game, uh, at least for Marvel 4, and I'm gonna pray all these things. <clears throat> uh, I will. <clears throat> yeah, I'll just kind of do it like this. Um, our mother, our father, our father, our mother, our God, our Lord, our Lord, our God, the daughter, sister, princess, and queen, the son, brother, prince, and king, our people, our creatures, our beings, and our things, I pray by, for, through, to, under, after, before, because of, with, in you, and in likeness of you, and always under, around, through, and within you. As you are our freedom, our will, our willing, our will power, and our holy and blood, word, and spirit. Um, I pray <clears throat> for for the people who would uh uh create uh Marvel vs. Capcom four. Uh I pray um for their freedom of will and blood, word and spirit, uh to uh become holy. In likeness of you, Jesus Christ, our Christ Jesus, Christ Jesus, our Jesus Christ. I pray um, for these are some of the things that I would like to see for Marvel for. <clears throat> sorry, y'all. I'm just kind of, I don't know. I'm sorry. Uh, but yeah, um, these are the things that I would like to see for Marvel for at least. Um, I would like to see that every character to have three useful assists. I would like for every character to be able to safely, safely DAC into another character that's like something that's really, really needed because <laughs> it's like it's it's like too many things revolve around the same character and it's like in order to like really change the meta behind it, you need characters that can do similar things to other characters as other characters can't do them and it's 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 like when it comes to ultimate marvel 3 it's it's not it's not as uh is it's not as as it needs to be for every character every character should be able to safely dac into another character that's i know that might be a problem <clears throat> sorry y'all uh, it might be a problem when it comes to when it comes to uh putting together the game but it should be able to be done in my opinion because it it just kind of helps the depth of the game completely when it comes to when it comes to uh when it comes to putting when it comes to putting together a team or then when it comes to uh playing a uh play a match and and then uh understanding what a what a character can do to get out of a situation <clears throat> and then 
and 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 when it just comes to like doing something safe and being safe in the game, it'll help with the, with the longevity of the game. Period. If everybody, if every character could safely DAC, uh, into into each other, uh, like just going forth and back is is just that's because that's what we be looking for when we build the teams, and it's it's like. It's like it's not always possible because I never mind. But anyways, uh, for crossover counters to be more useful, um, and if so, more invincible, uh, a strategy for certain characters to be able to nullify and dodge or nullify or dodge projectiles, as well as set up traps and more counters against projectiles. <clears throat> Um, for characters without flight to be able to stand their ground against strategies of characters that can fly, that's something that's really, really needed because it wasn't really evident in Marvel 2. And then it went, it's like nothing, it's like it didn't really play out too well in Marvel, in Marvel, in Ultimate Marvel 3. And it's just like, it's like, it's like, yeah, the game is kind of played more horizontally where you're playing on the ground, but it's it's still like as we can see from like more doom, it's it's still like is it's we people need to be able to fight more on the ground against flying characters. Um, and then also for the game to be played just as much on the ground as in flight. Um, and then for all or at least more characters to be able to have air to ground or even ground to air combos would, uh, would be really, really cool, uh, if that's, like, implemented into the next Marvel game. And, uh, for more of every character to be able to throw out an attack that can safely raw tag a character in. So it's like with certain characters you can you can kind of throw out an attack uh such as like uh I guess uh I guess like Strider throwing out a bomb and then and then uh safely raw tagging someone in that's that's then what I'm talking about more characters should be able to do that because sometimes you can't switch with a DHC sometimes you don't have a meter uh that would be that would be really good and then more ways and scenarios to raw tag a character in and then uh and then this again this is then just from how I'm thinking about the game or at least for what I would want from Marvel 4 um I believe that each team uh should be able to work well with only two team members remaining just as well as um just as well as the entire team of three team members working together completely so it's like as as we kind of know like Wolvie and Akuma are like best friends but it's just kind of like if if uh one of those characters dies or any kind of in any kind of way then the the team is then almost kind of crippled in a sense, but it just, it then all still depends on how you build your team, right, so, so, um, so, yeah, it's just, like, every, every team should be able to work well with just two characters remaining, um, and, and then, like, and then also what I see is that, um, I believe, like, every character should basically have all the same tools as just about every other character is, it, it's just about like every other character in the game. Um, for any like any just really like good character that they're that's put together really well, they should be able to have all the tools that 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 other characters have, such as like like X twenty three being able to OTG um, without OTG into combo without X Factor level three or two. Right? Is that would that would be really cool, but I understand that certain things don't work, and I understand that everybody's not me, and and then these are just my opinions of what I would want in for 
uh, another Marvel game. So, uh, so yeah, Jesus Christ, our Christ Jesus, Christ Jesus, our Jesus Christ. Um, as these are the things that uh, I could just see. Um, I pray that the developers can see this video about Marvel Four, uh, as well as uh, it would be really cool if uh, if it was possible for all the characters in the MCU to be able to to kind of be implemented into Marvel Four. That would be man. <laughs> And then also return some Capcom characters such as like X in Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite. Like he, I never, I I haven't really had a chance to play that game enough, but I would like to see him return as well as like Zero and Virgil and Dante and uh, Trish and then even like Nero and like, I would like to see a lot, even like the Resident Evil characters. It's like when it comes to Marvel, it seems like that game can only get bigger because of so many characters in the Marvel universe and then so many characters in the Capcom universe, as well as the fact that you could just bring back other characters from the Capcom and Marvel universe. So, Jesus Christ, I Christ Jesus, um... I've been praying for it, been thinking about it, and uh, and I'm putting it on video. So um, I pray that uh, you can work through uh, all the people who would develop the next Marvel game, Jesus Christ or Christ Jesus, and to help them see um, this video as well as to help them see um, newer things that they could uh, implement into the next Marvel 4 video game, Jesus Christ or Christ Jesus. Um, Cause uh, if anything on this list kind of gets in, it just seems like it would it would just be money for everybody. <laughs> Cause it is that Marvel. So uh, so yeah, uh, Jesus Christ, I Christ Jesus, I pray that uh, that uh, that anyone who sees this video and uh will want other things implemented to the video, I pray that they pray about it. And I pray that the developers pray about uh about the next installation into the uh Marvel franchise as well as I pray that uh video game designers begin to pray for their uh their uh games that they create uh in the future. Jesus Christ, our Christ Jesus, I praise you are the all creating God our God, Lord our Lord, Jesus Christ our Christ Jesus. Um as uh as everyone um as as many people and as to what i'm trying to do is to help uh people believe in you and have faith in you jesus christ our christ jesus i know that this is just a video game and this is just kind of hoping and wishing <laughs> but uh i pray that uh it gets into it gets into the right hands and the right hearts and the right minds uh to truly understand uh, what we want from the next Marvel, uh, Marvel, uh, uh, Marvel thing, iteration, yeah, Jesus Christ, I Christ Jesus, I praise you, our God, our Lord, and our Lord, our God, and the all-providing, all-supplying, Jesus Christ, I Christ Jesus, I pray as we all love you, regardless of whatever happens, um, as you, as, uh, we are all humble servants of you, Jesus Christ, our Christ Jesus, I praise you are our God, our Lord, and our Lord, our God, for whatever your all will is behind this, uh, I pray that it happens, Jesus Christ, our Christ Jesus, I pray, amen, so yeah, y'all, it is that Marvel, sorry, sorry we like 14 minutes into the video, but it is that Marvel, though, <laughs> so yeah, y'all, uh, yeah, and then also, we need new, uh, we need, like, we need something like a costume, uh, what am I talking about, uh, something like King of Fighters, where it comes to, uh, the, the color palette of characters, man, though, <laughs> no, I'm just dreaming, though, but, uh, but yeah, I can't wait for the next Marvel, but I'm still going to be playing that Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3, y'all. Uh, 
when I can, as I can. So I know nobody's heard of me, but I feel like I'm a genius at that game, and uh, I love that game. So uh, see y'all in the next video.